Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have for you an Ulta and Sephora haul. So I'm gonna show you everything that I bought from Ulta and Sephora recently. I've been doing this over so long. I do have another package coming in either today or tomorrow. So that'll be included just in a different haul just because I placed some more orders since then. So um, if you do like project panning, hauls, Shop my stash weekly makeup baskets, which I do every single week here on my channel. Then go ahead and like and subscribe. Helps my small channel a lot and I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. And now let's go ahead and get into today's video. Let's go ahead and start off with Sephora. Um, my dog did get into my package. So some of these things are bidden up, but I will show you guys. Anyways, um, Sephora was having a really good sale. So I did get this um, perfume by Muggler. Mugler, not really sure how you say it. It's the Angel Nova. I fell in love with the sample. And this is the Oud de Toilette. And mm, I can smell it through the box. And it looks like this. This is what the actual bottle looks like. So yeah, I will throw the sale price. I forgot how much it was, but it was not that expensive. And my dog got to the box, but everything inside is still nice. So I'm glad that I got this on a great deal. I cannot wait to wear that one. I've been super really into perfume. And then I did get this on sale as well. And this are three beauty blenders and two soaps and a little mat to clean like your sponges on. I think I might use that for brushes just because sometimes my hands get raw for me rubbing it in my hands. So I'm glad I got like a little mat here on the bottom and this was like 36 bucks i believe and that puts um these a little under ten dollars a piece and yeah and the soaps for a few bucks in the map so super and i'm like super thrilled that the price is right and i needed some new sponges and i haven't used beauty blenders in a while i've been using um some drugstore brands but yeah i'm happy to return back to my roots because i used to be a beauty blender girl i did purchase my favorite um moisturizer it was on sale for black friday so i did get these two moisturizers they're the confidence and cream two fluid ounces my favorite moisturizer i am wearing it today this is what it looks like right here i believe this is a two ounce as well yeah this is a two ounce i used to get the four ounce but um yeah as you guys can see i'm almost out of this one so this is my favorite moisturizer especially in the winter time for dry skin i think it's very luxurious creamy moisturizing on the skin so i'm glad i got this on a super good deal i will throw the sale price here on the screen so you guys know i think these are like half off ulta had them on sale for 40 percent off but um these are half off on the sephora website so i'm glad that i got these on a, an amazing still the benefit brow pencils were also half off so i did get two for the price of one my dog got into this one but he didn't get into this one so i picked up two and they're in the shade 4.5 neutral deep brown so yeah five was a little deep on me so i went down a step to see if this brow pencil was a little bit better needed some brow pencils so i picked these two up i really do like deep precising my brow a little bit more stiffer and a little waxier than i prefer i prefer the brow is by abh but a great alternative and yeah for $12.50 a piece i don't think that's too bad that's drugstore pricing i did get another perfume by muggler mugular however you say it this is the Oudo perfume and alien goddess so this one is a travel and i believe oh, this one was really cheap 10 20 bucks i'll throw it on the screen right here and everybody knows muggler is super expensive i love this alien this alien this uh like crystal shaped packaging let me give it a good whiff mm, this one this one smells super good and kind of familiar like i don't know what the notes are on this but i'm getting like maybe a coconut or just something so inviting and like i don't know like i've smelled this before somewhere super good so i am happy with that i am definitely wanting to pick up some more perfumes by muggler muggler however you say it let me know in the comment section down below i did get a um power pocket puff dual sided powder puff by beauty blender this was on sale for like i think 11 bucks or so so yeah these are all the rage right now i know you can get cheaper ones like on amazon or 
AOA and stuff like that. It's just I don't purchase from those sites very often. So shipping would kind of be, you know, a lot because I'm just purchasing this like, you know, I don't want a whole bunch of dollar makeup. Um, I prefer quality over quantity. Um, the little bit of drugstore makeup that I do buy are like from brands that I've tried before and I know the products work well and if they don't work out I always just you know um rehome them and stuff like that but I kind of just stick to my niche my Dior my Chanel like I feel comfortable in that zone um so yeah I didn't want to pick up any um m like some more affordable versions of these but yeah this was on sale that i go ahead and grab that to see what all the rage is and then if you spent like a hundred dollars or more you would get like some more luxurious type of uh samples fragrance type of stuff so i caught some right here that my dad got into this candle it smells so good this is the grapefruit um scented candle it says bougie parfumé by Nest new york i'm not lying it does say that i don't think my phone will focus on it but it says it on there um love the way grapefruit smells so this little candle will sit back here and when it's ready to be burned up i freaking finish up my fall candle maybe i will bust into this um and then i did get these by clean reserve this is the lush floor perfume it says family fresh florals crafted with sustainable notes of dash mass rose from turkey i don't know all the notes that are on this but um I like the pink label and this one also smells very nice and familiar not super florally from what i can tell like it is just the right amount of freshness and then this one is um an eau de parfum floral musk and this is the radiant nectar and this is a 0.10 fluid ounce or 3 mls also a little baby guy and let's smell it mm yeah i'm definitely getting like some kind of citrus it's reminding me of that nest orange oil perfume but a little tone tone down you're getting a little bit of peachy scent in there very nice i like that maybe nectarine i'm not sure and then i did have two samples i don't know if my dog just shot it the other one i couldn't find it but i did get the flower balm ruby orchid Uda perfume and then it was a different one i think it was volce vita or something like that um but yeah this one's very nice but i have a lot of these so i might just gift some of these to my daughter so i can enjoy some of these um but that was everything for sephora so let's go ahead and move on to ulta so i got my ulta package here i'm gonna open it up Here are the items. I think I purchased this before I purchased this stuff at Ulta. Had to re-up on my favorite lashes. These are the lashes that I'm wearing today. I have a pretty dark smoky eye, so you're not gonna be able to see them that well. But these are the Ilore Luxe Silk Marquise um, lashes. They look super pretty. I've been wearing these a lot. Here's like a demo thing, but I don't know if these are the actual lashes she's wearing. Like, I don't know, I feel like they're different, but um yeah i think i got these for free in an ulta order one time and these are the free pair that i have on and i had to pick these up these were on sale for like eight or nine bucks i'll throw up the price sell price here and these are mm, a little bit more expensive than that when they're not on sale but you can get a 15 percent off coupon so that makes them even cheaper and then i did get some more lashes here these are the matte black faux meat collection limited time only so it's a little holiday kit they come with matte silk matte, matte velvet matte satin and matte chenille chenille i don't know um i think i've tried matte velvet is that matte velvet yeah and those are some of my favorite big like um looks like lash extension type of lashes so these are going to be for you know um when i'm going to parties and stuff like that but for everyday filming videos these are very nice but got these on sale throw the sale price up i believe these might have been cheaper but these have less these ha these have three and then these have four these are usually like eight or nine dollars a piece so the fact that i got three of them that's a good deal and these are like six dollars a piece or somewhere around there so also a very good deal that i got those from ulta's black friday deals and then i 
did purchase a beauty blender because these were 10 bucks and that's before i purchased these so and i have like four so that's pretty much enough for the year so if my kids don't shred them if i don't lose them and if i'm gentle and soft and great with them then i should have enough for all of 2024 so i mean three it's color changing so i like the cute little box thing maybe i might um open it and leave the top off and just put this in here to kind of dry and not be like rolling around on my table or anything weird i just usually keep mine like sitting on top of my brushes this is like the wet and wild one that i'm using with snoopy on it it's disgusting right now but i use it for my makeup and wash it out and doesn't really get the stains out but i'm glad this is more like orangey skin tone color so it's not gonna look as filthy so 10 bucks for that and then i did um get my abh brow gel this is my favorite clear brow gel so they had this in a kit for like 21 bucks but i think this one was on sale for like 18 bucks and this is a full size the other one was a full size and a mini for like 20 something bucks but i just went ahead and just only got the full size this lasts me a very good amount of time i just wanted to save my extra three dollars <laughs> 19 20 21 yeah three dollars then these were like 30 percent off a lot of mac stuff was 30 percent off but i resisted buying a whole bunch of mac stuff i've been wanting oak again i've been telling you guys that i lost oak and been wanting it again so i did pick up the lip pencil in oak and these last few years i literally had my mac lip liners that are up there for about two to three years now and they are creamy and i've only used up maybe that much in two or three years so they're gonna last you an eternity and then i did get um some freebies with this order so let me show you guys what it is it's this beautiful pouch oh my god purple is my favorite color and this velvet mm, so beautiful i think this will be my little makeup to go type of bag that i'll keep in my purse with this fugis essential just in case if i'm ever somewhere that i need to wear makeup and i like to save these to keep my makeup fresh but um yeah i'll, I'll save that um it came with this these goodies right here we have a blush and highlighter duo so i'm probably gonna use that in my next shop my stash then we have this lipstick don't know what shade we have an eye matte eye primer we have a mattifying face primer and then i don't know if this is a gloss and i think this might be lash glue or something uh, no this is a clear brow gel so i'll have to try that out i love trying out brow gels right now i'm wearing the nyx uh glue and it looks pretty good i didn't like it at first but i think there's a learning curve um so yeah here is the eye primer which i don't buy anymore i just use concealer but i might try that out and then we have a mattifying face primer which if this is that silicone ish primer i do not like it so i will open it and see if it is or not and if it is i'll just get rid of it give it to a family member we have this tinted juice infused oil which is this pretty nude shade let me see this pretty nude shade oh so gorgeous it's wrapped up so i won't open it and then this is the blush. Look out for a shut my stash. That one will be thrown into a shut my stash. Then we have this beautiful, looks like a reddish color. I could be wrong though. This is a lipstick in the shade Raisin. So yeah, I think it's gonna be like a reddish brown color. And then, oh, this cute little palette. This is the clear brow gel. Let me open this up it has wrapper on it as do all the products but i just want to see what this pack looks like in person love the stars very holiday s it's like these gold stars on it and over here it looks like that on the back and this is their eyeshadow palette that's just the name of it <laughs> and oh this is giving me la rock vibes we have some nudie colors this reminds me of like uh, abh shadow like orange soda or whatever is in the modern renaissance and this brownie color is giving me a shade that i've seen by abh before even this brown is giving me abh vibes this is a nice reddish pink more taupey color and a cool tone dark brown so here are the shades i think this will be a good everyday palette so this one will probably be 
in a shop my stash as well is this magnetic i think it might be magnetic so that's pretty cool i was glad to get that and i think it was like if you bought like 65 dollars or more you would get these goodies so super happy so i'll swatch everything um of those and my next shop my stash so keep an eye out for that we have a ton of goodies to try in that video well i won't be trying them in that video but you know i'll swatch them for you guys and use them for a week but yeah i really well, let's see the charm on this really quickly i love a good charm okay it's just a little round charm but super cute love details um so that was everything that i got from ulta i do have another package like i said that's coming with how many things did i get in there Oh no, actually it's, it's a four it's a Sephora package with two things in there. And then I did place an Ulta order. So more things to come. So stay tuned. Hope you guys have an amazing blessed day wherever you are. And I'll see you all in my next video. Mwah. Bye.